Welcome to Cooking with Beats. My name is Ryan, and I'll be your host. Today, we have a very special episode featuring a bean that bears energy, warmth, and a stimulating, mind-altering experience. This bean is the coffee bean, and when brewed correctly, the experience is quite nice. Coffee is one of my favorite morning beverages. Although it's not my first, it's a close second. Today's recipe features a decaf bean that will be brewed using the pour over method. And I think it came out quite nice. With that being said, let's get brewing. All right, so like I said, we're gonna be using a decaf coffee bean here. This one's from Kicking Horse Coffee. Got it at my local natural grocery store. So first we're going to weigh out our coffee grounds do seven grams for one cup I just put the lid of the contain of the lid of the coffee grinder on the scale to weigh it and I believe that came out to a good seven grams here next we're gonna grind it up real nice with this with this coffee grinder here really pay attention to the sounds here. We're gonna do something special at the end with all the sounds that came from this video. So we're gonna get a bit of a chunky grind here just to you know, get that good, good chunky, chunkiness out of it. Gonna smack the hell out of it. grind I got out of it. A bit chunky. Whatever you prefer. Next, I'm going to put some water in my cup and then put it into my boiler. It's got a coffee sending on there. I believe it's at 205 degrees Fahrenheit. Super precise. So we're going to let that heat up back on. And next we're going to put our filter in. Now this is optional. It does have a metal filter that came along with it, but uh, it's more of a cleaner brew if you have the extra filter as well. I put the grounds in there. sure there is but the way I do it is just kind of pour circular let it bloom just keep on brewing Nice drip going here. Uh, looks perfect. Got some really cool sounds out of this one. You'll see the song that I put together after this. But after that, you're all ready. It's done. And you can just pour it back into your cup. And really enjoy from here. Compare it with some creamer, sugar. Whichever you prefer, or just drink it black. Before we jump into the song, I'd like to show you a bit of a breakdown of what I did here. 
So as you can see, the video file is up at the top here. So for the kick drum, This was actually the lid closing. Yeah, you can come somewhat see that, but that was a, the clip where I was putting the cat back on the kettle. This hat. If I had to guess, that's the pitched cap. This I threw in a sampler for the sub, just a quick bit of the, of the coffee grinder. And actually these chords are the coffee grinder as well. Interesting enough, the coffee grinder I believe tuned to a solid C. And this came out to be a cool loop, just for some texture. So that's the coffee beans going into, as you can see right there, going into the cap. I'm gonna add some candy down here. reverb, some other things on this, not a lot of processing, and this bit, I believe that's coffee beans as well, this too, but yeah that's about the gist, um, all of this was made from the video, so this is sampled sounds from the video. You gotta click here. Probably one of my favorite sounds here. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the tune. Thank you guys for sticking around to the end. If you liked the video, please subscribe. It really helps out the channel. And also give this video a thumbs up. If you got any suggestions on what I should cook next, comment down below. Anyways, thanks again and have a great day.